Hey everyone, welcome to Chalchitra Talks. My name is Samira. Hai. This week, I want to recommend to you three amazing musical projects from the genre of contemporary jazz that you should definitely check out if you're a fan of fusion music or simply looking to explore different kinds of music, especially fusion music. Jazz as a genre is still quite new to me and coming across these three projects has been very eye opening for me on how diverse the genre can get and how so many amazing artists have managed to take the basic elements of jazz in so many different directions bringing in their own regional influences or even influences from other genres the fourth project that i want to talk about is actually including two groups that are related these are shakti and remember shakti Shakti was a jazz fusion band formed in the 1970s by the English guitarist John McLaughlin along with the amazing Indian tabla player Zakir Hussain also including some several more um, band members such as a violinist and a ghatam player this band combined jazz along with indian classical music and more specifically hindustani and carnatic classic music this group was active from 1974 to 1977 and about 20 years later john mcclellan and zakir hussain came back together to form a group on the same concept uh, and this group was called remember shakti this time including some different band members um, and also including the amazing indian vocalist shankar mahadevan i also highly recommend checking out their live performance videos because i think that's the best way you can properly appreciate the nature of their fusion work i want to recommend some songs from both shakti as well as remember shakti from remember shakti please check out lotus feet luki shringar and giriraj sidha from shakti please check out mind ecology face to face happiness is being together peace of mind and lady l the second jazz artist that i want to talk about is tigran hamasyan he is a jazz pianist from armenia and he his music definitely has to be one of my most treasured finds in 2020 as well as in the area of jazz uh, again coming across his music has been mind blowing for me in how diverse the genre can get tigran's music is strongly influenced by armenian folk tradition and he combines armenian folk music along with contemporary jazz and progressive rock more specifically math rock of the few math rock bands that i have got a chance to listen to most of them have been guitar based but what tigran does very differently and something that i heard for the very first time was playing math rock time signatures on the piano he has a mix of instrumental songs as well as songs with vocals and also often collaborates with a lot of other artists uh, to contribute vocals in his music i honestly have been obsessed with tigran's music for very long now and i don't think i've been this obsessed with a piano player since ludovico einaudi so if you're someone who enjoys um listening to experimental and contemporary instrumental music like ludovico has then the tigran's music is something you should definitely check out some songs that i want to highly recommend from tigran hamasan's music are as follows the poet drip road song lilac sea farer out of the grid and our film i also want to recommend two albums that are must listen if you enjoyed the songs by tigran that i have recommended and you should definitely listen to these albums all at once the albums are sea farer and the mock root the last jazz band that i want to recommend is called gogo penguin and they are a instrumental contemporary jazz band they are a three member band from england uh, comprising of a pianist a double bassist and a drummer this band combines jazz along with ambient electronic rock and classic music what i personally love about gogo penguins music in addition to their amazing name is that despite being purely instrumental the music has some really powerful melodies this is to be another one of my favorite discoveries in contemporary jazz and a lot of their songs are just very mesmerizing in terms of being super catchy and experimental some songs that you should definitely check out from gogo penguin are as follows garden dog barbecue fort kora Bardo and Window. Um, two albums that you should check out from this band are Version 2.0 and the self-titled album Go Go Penguin. So these are some of my favorite contemporary jazz projects that I have discovered so far. I would love to know what you think about them. 
I'll be back soon with another recommendation. Thank you.